What was your this person is on another level of stupid moment? Dude burned down his convenience store for an insurance claim. And stopped the milk and bread deliveries a day before. Demolished my right foot and a bunch of other shit in a motorcycle crash. And had to have the top of my foot removed. Guy I work with asked me when it would grow back. I explained that the skin and stuff was going to have to be grafted. But the tendons and bones that had been removed were gone forever. He looked me dead in the eye and asked why. Don't they just cut the whole ducking thing off and let it grow back? Going through security and the person says I need to show a different form of ID. I ask why, because I gave them my driver's license. They say I need a US document like a green card or something. I'm a US citizen. Then I realized. I explained how District of Columbia is long for DC. Like Washington DC. As in the capital of our country. I got a bad grade in geography in high school. My teacher kept trying to push me and suggested I talk to my parents about it. I told my mom I was failing geography and she said how ducking stupid can you really be Justin? How do you fail geography it's just shapes I'll never forget that one. Texagon. United Shapes of America. Co-worker bought a low flow shower head. He filled the bathtub using the new low flow shower head because it would use less water. That's like cutting a pizza into 6 pieces because I couldn't eat 8. While driving from one big city to another, I stopped in a small town to eat at a fast food chain in Texas. I order my food, get my orange number tent and sit down to wait for my order. The lady who's bringing out orders has this. I give up demeanor as she's calling out numbers that guests aren't claiming. Each time this happens, she speaks to a couple tables to seemingly figure out who food is for. Then I hear her call for number 55 while holding a tray of food for one person. I was number 54 and noticed I was the only single party guest there. We make eye contact and she heads towards me. She confirms my order with me and says sorry. For some reason the computer prints one number higher. I immediately ask well then why don't you just call out one number lower than what's printed. She freezes and I can see the gears turning in her head. I tell her thank you and she goes on her way. I'm an identical twin and have been asked all manner of utterly ridiculous questions about it throughout my life. But I think the stupidest was when a girl once asked me do you ever get yourselves mixed up with each other. I responded are you asking me if I ever sometimes think I'm my brother. She replied. Yeah. No. I don't. When I was in middle school I was in art class with a boy named Devon. I told him my sister has the same name as him and he asked me what her name was. The time I watched someone who had missed their exit on the highway stop on the shoulder, back up, turn around and go up the entrance ramp. I could not ducking believe it. I work for Parks Canada in Yoho National Park. I have been asked the question seriously. Where do you keep the animals at night? Twice in my career. To this day I still find great joy imagining what they thought was going on each night as we collected every large animal in the parks. I was a co-hostess with a girl in a restaurant, watching ads on a hanging TV for a new movie. At the end, it said coming soon to a theater near you. To which she turned to me with wide eyes genuinely asked how do they know where I live? This was my first experience in retail, where I learned what many customers would be like. Seasons were changing. So we put a lot of shirts we had to get rid of in the front, and made them 50% off. I was working the register, when a woman came up to buy her things. I rang her up, and could see a look on her face, like something was wrong. That's when the following happened. Lady why is this so much? Me pardon me. Lady this should only be 10 not 20. I thought that maybe her item was on sale. So I asked if she could point out the sign, because I wasn't aware of it. It was a small store and we didn't have to walk anywhere. Lady the sign here. Me this sign says that all shirts are 50% off. Lady yes. So why is this full price? Me this is a hat. 
Back when the Fukushima nuclear power plant disaster happened we were discussing how the reactor had failed in a science class. Five minutes into the conversation a girl piped up and said I don't see what the big deal is. Why can't we just regrow it? She dead ass thought a nuclear power plant was a plant. Summer camp counselor made all the kids on a school bus keep the windows up on a hot day because they could feel the air conditioning coming from the front of the bus. It was so hot, and I may be 10 years old at the time, had to explain to the 40 year old counselor that the air conditioning they were feeling was the wind coming in through the bus driver's open window. She still didn't believe me. I begged her to ask the bus driver to confirm the bus did not have air conditioning, but she didn't want to bother him while he was driving. It was like a one hour bus trip. She finally got hot enough and asked the bus driver if the bus had air conditioning. And he jokingly said the bus only has air conditioning when the windows are down and the wheels are turning. She then looked back at me and said see, I told you the bus had air conditioning and proceeded to force us to keep the windows up. We asked our classmate to prove she knew the seven continents. Her list went like this. North America, Europe, China, the Pacific Ocean, I should you not. Watching a man try to open the locked front door of my shop, while a bright red closed sign was literally inches from his face. He kept looking at the door, like it was just stuck. There was a girl in my high school who forced the teacher to pause a documentary about people living in mud huts in Africa because she was upset that they were showing us fictional movies in a history class. It took everyone else in the room to convince her that people actually live like that in some places. Wealthy area living for ya. I was friends with with a guy who believed those fake Apple adverts like Apple Wave Microwave your phone for instant battery charge I was so dumbfounded that he actually fell for it when I saw him the week after and he had a new phone it all clicked for me. When I was younger I was mad that everyone else had an accent and I didn't. Three years later I realized that I did in fact have an accent and that I was on another level of stupid. Knew a girl in middle school that didn't understand the concept of perspective. She also thought north was whichever direction you were facing at the time. How much is a half dollar worth? She was the newest teller my boss hired. We'll never forget that moment. Had someone ask me is Europe on Earth? Actually Europa is a moon of Jupiter. A friend didn't have coins for a vending machine, but did have a dollar. She folded up the dollar and forced it into the coin slot and then did not understand why she did not get her item. For me I had a concussion and was getting x-rays taken. They gave me a lead blanket to wrap around my twig and berries. I took it and wrapped it around me like a cape. I could not understand what they wanted me to do. In your defense, you were concussed. Someone in my history class argued that misogyny was a type of pasta. I was helping a colleague with his graduate thesis film. My job was to animate a solar eclipse. Since we couldn't shoot one for real, I animated it using some real life reference footage to make it look realistic. When I showed him, he asked why the moon was black and had no detail. I asked him if he had ever seen a solar eclipse and he replied yes of course. But I want this one to look surreal since it's the moon in front of the sun. It's not like a normal solar eclipse. At this point it became clear something was amiss, and after asking a few more clarifying questions it became clear he had no idea that the large object passing in front of the sun during a solar eclipse is, in fact, the moon. I confronted him about it, and he apologized for not being great with astrology. At least he tried to apologize. I used to work with a girl who was sweet but so dumb. We were in a meeting once and somehow someone mentioned baked ham. My manager said ugh I hate ham. It looks like human flesh. The girl I mentioned was sitting next to me and looked horrified and whispered, does ham really come from people? A group of late teens sitting outside my building assuring each other that all criminal charges would be dropped when they reached 21. DUIs. Drug charges. Traffic violations. Everything. 
I walked away shaking my head, because they were in for a reality check. At, at the time I was working at a grocery store that had a coinsta machine. Basically you could place all of your unwrapped change in it, and it would be converted for a small fee, that you could use for actual cash. I was walking past, and noticed a woman struggle with the machine. I stopped to help her. Turns out she had accidentally hit Spanish as a language selection. I quickly explained what she needed to do figuring she couldn't read Spanish we were in the US and this is where her struggles came from. So I run through how it works, and show her where the receipt will print out, that she can turn in at customer service for the cash. She turns and looks at me and says, but I don't want Spanish money. Sigh. Then I have to explain to her, that she would get paid in US dollars. Consider subscribing if you enjoyed this video, and if you want to see more of Reddit Universe, 